Marge? Marge Simpson. You remember me, don't you? I'm Helen Lovejoy, the gossipy wife of the minister. Oh, yes. Hello, Helen. Well, I had just finished eating and was about to leave when I looked over this way and said to myself, why, isn't that Marge Simpson over there having brunch with a man who isn't her husband? <laughs> and I just had to come over and say hello. We're, um... Oh, don't squirm on my account. I am giving her a bowling lesson. Thank you. Now, Marge, uh, the pins on the 3710 split would be here. Hmm. Uh, we'll make this little piece of food the ball. The ball's bigger, you know that. Mm -hmm. But for food, this is a good ball. Uh, well, bye-bye. See you in church on Sunday, Marge. Goodbye, Helen. Goodbye, Helen. You have a lovely friend there. Mm -hmm. Let's hope something runs over her. <laughs> <laughs> Your laughter is like music to me. But if you laugh at what I say next, I will die. For I am about to say something very serious. Perhaps shocking. Marge, my darling, I want you to meet with me again. That doesn't shock me. Away from prying eyes, away from the heavens of the world. At my apartment, the Fiesta Terrace. <gasps> I've been waiting for you. Come in, my captivating one. May I have this dance? Sure. You certainly have a lot of bowling trophies. <laughs> mm. oh, I like you so much. <laughs> They're not for bowling, Marge. You're so naive. They're for lovemaking. Really? Yes. Oh! Champagne? Please. There, my darling. Thank you. What cosmic force brought us together, Marge? Destiny? Yes. Some divine pin spotter must have placed us side by side. Like two fragile bowling pins. Standing bravely. Until inevitably... We must topple. Marge, speak to me. Is Thursday okay? It's okay indeed.